What up guys, this is Kedzdex, 1337, signing in from the Pearl of the Orient Seas. And today, I'm here to teach you how to fix a 2.5 external hard drive. I was working last night and it just suddenly stopped. My computer won't detect it. And uh, it makes this annoying beeping noise. Anyway, um, let's get things going. First, uh, let's start with the things you'll need. You'll need one of these. It is a... Uh, well, the guy at the hardware store called it a P7 screwdriver. It's star-shaped. It'll help you take off the screws of your external hard drive. One of these. It's a normal screwdriver that I bent to make a hook. You'll need it to open your enclosure. Just in case you have the, the, the lock type one. The one that doesn't need screw. The snap fit one. If your hard disk is like mine, the snap fit one. You're gonna have to reach around the edges. You'll hear a clipping noise. Just gonna take your small hook, stick it in there. Run it to the sides. Once open, this is what it looks like. This is your external hard drive. Now, just to show you, mine doesn't work. I'll plug it in. It makes this beeping sound. And then the computer won't detect it. Uh, it has some screws bolting it on the side. Just take your standard Phillips screwdriver and just take all four out of there and you can just slip it out. All four screws are removed. You can just yank it to the side gently and there we go. You have to remove this part And now you're left with the hard drive itself. Now you've removed all six screws. Now what I need you to do is remove the sticker carefully. Just take it off. And you'll see one more screw is in there. You have to take it out to be able to open the hard disk. Now this is where it gets serious. I need you to take a cloth, start wiping your hands, make sure there's no sweat, turn off any fans or anything that could uh, get in, dust into your hard disk because that can seriously damage it. Uh, you can take a piece of cloth, just put it on your face and make a small mask to make sure your breathing doesn't get all the way in there. Now, once you're done, you have to just open your hard disk carefully. Now, you can just see the problem there is this, uh, the needle is stuck on the hard disk, preventing it to spin. I need you to take your P7, put it in the middle, and your improvised hook to just assist it, rotate it counterclockwise, and just yank on it carefully.
Alright, now it's free. Once free, it's back to its original position. You need to put back the case and put all the bolts back and including the sticker. Okay, it's back together. Now you have to get your enclosure piece over here, put it in your hard disk. And now let's test it if it works. And there it is. It works. <laughs> um, I've done this only twice. And I'm happy it's a success. At first I experimented on it. Now your hard disk, if it has a three-year warranty, you have to give it back if it's under warranty. They'll give you a new one. Um, once you've done this fix, uh, I've read some in the net that it can come back. Uh, it, it might be a factory defect, the discs might not fit well or something like that. Anyway, now you can back it up or, I don't know, maybe sell it if you want a new one. But everything's back now. Um, all my files, I can see them, I can play videos again or anything that was in here before. There are some cases where the needle broke the disc and you can't fix that. It's a, it's a total wreck. Anyway, I hope this helps. Uh, click like and subscribe on the video. And I'll make more if there's anything else I need to get fixed. Good hunting, guys.